Duchess Meghan, Duchess Kate definitely had issues seeing eye to eye on joint charity. Duchess Meghan is doing things her own way once again. After Kensington Palace formally announced on Thursday, June 20, that she and Prince Harry were breaking away from Prince William and Duchess Kate's charity, the Royal Foundation opens a new window, to start their own. A Royal Insider exclusively reveals in the new issue of Us Weekly that the Fab Four were experiencing creative differences ahead of the split. Kensington Palace is painting this as a natural progression, says the Insider, but there were definitely issues with Meghan and Kate seeing eye to eye on how they wanted to run this charity. While the Duchess of Sussex, 37, wanted to be more involved, create initiatives and be in the trenches, the Duchess of Cambridge, also 37, wanted to be more hands-off. There isn't, however, a disagreement or rift between the royal ladies, who have been plagued with feud rumors for the last year, says the insider, but the mom of seven-week-old Archie is figuring out what she can do in terms of being active, and more, comfortable with her role. More details have emerged on what led to Meghan Markle and Prince Harry exiting the Royal Foundation, the charity that they ran with Prince William and Kate Middleton. The move officially happened on Thursday, June 20, following a board meeting held in an effort to review its current structure. Officials said that the decision was made in an effort to better align the two couples' charitable efforts and made sure to note that they'll continue to work together in the future. Insiders tell us weekly, however, that it was more than just a desire to realign their efforts that drove the second royal split in several months. Harry and Meghan moved out of Kensington Palace where the Cambridges live, this spring. Kensington Palace is painting this as a natural progression, the source said. But there were definitely issues with Meghan and Kate seeing eye to eye on how they wanted to run this charity. The insider went on to explain that Meghan wanted to be move involved and create initiatives and be in the trenches, while Kate wanted a more hands-off role in the organization which has been renamed the Royal Foundation of the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge and used to be the umbrella organization for the likes of Heads Together, the Invictus Games and the Endeavour Fund. While the two duchesses may have disagreed on the direction of their charitable efforts, any reports of a disagreement or rift being behind the decision aren't accurate, the source added. Hey, hi, hello. This morning we've got some tea about Kate Middleton and Meghan Markle and why they really split their royal charity with Prince William and Prince Harry last week. But first. Before you get all, OMG, feud update comma I must alert the masses, chill, friend. There's no feud. There's no disagreement or rift. Turns out, the split reportedly happened because of a totally understandable difference in opinion, which makes sense especially since a source says there were some issues brewing between the duchesses. Kensington Palace is painting this as a natural progression, a source told us weekly. But there were definitely issues with Meghan and Kate seeing eye to eye on how they wanted to run this charity. The source said the difference really came down to how involved they wanted to be in the details of their charity work. Meghan wanted to be more involved, create initiatives and be in the trenches. Kate, on the other hand, preferred to be more hands-off. Obviously, this was a problem, so breaking up the charity in the end was probably the best call for everyone. In the meantime, Meghan's the mom of newborn BB Archie Harrison, so the source said she's figuring out what she can do in terms of being active, and more, comfortable. Harry, meanwhile, supports her but recommends that she move with ease, according to the source. Still, the increased scrutiny and frenzy of attention is tough to handle, even after all these months. It's hard for Meghan in London because the press is so vicious to her there, a source said. This is her life. But her mentality is like, well, if this is what it's going to be like, I'm going to do what I want to do. I won't play by these rules.